up, world? Like I said, it's your boy Damien, Black Ops Entertainment, Black Ops TV. We are glad to be back in front of you. Oh, man, there's been so much going on lately that, you know, we're supposed to start this thing, kick this thing off back in July. Wouldn't happen. Wouldn't let it happen. Just too much going on. But, you know, I was able to find some time on a Wednesday night to try to get this thing done. So, yeah, that's what we're going to do today. We're going to get this thing done. Uh, we're going to talk about a few things. Um... We're going to talk about some headline news. We're going to talk about some upcoming events that we got going on. Uh, we're going to talk about the um, Black Ops new music um, provided by Apple Music. Also, we're going to talk about the Black Ops Summer Madness free ticket giveaway. Y'all need to be up on that, all right? I'll, I'll give y'all more information about that. And we're going to talk about the Crush Report with Crush Model Magazine. All right? So we got these things going on. So let's get into it. But before we do, we need you to like it this video subscribe to this video and hit the notification button so you'll know when we drop another video okay if y'all do that that'll be great also you can find us on all of our um, social media platforms on um, Facebook is Black Ops Entertainment IG is Black Ops Entertainment on Twitter we're Black Ops all right and of course on YouTube we are Black Ops Entertainment or Black Ops TV uh, first thing I would like to talk about, and this is kind of major. I don't know if you guys heard about this story, but um, have you guys gone see the Candyman? I hope you have, because that is the number one movie in the country right now. And also, it is the first time that an African American woman has topped the charts at the box office with a number one movie, and that is Miss Nina Da Costa. She is the first black female director to debut the U.S. box office at number one. And, of course, she, um, she was the one who um, directed Candyman. Um, and that, that's, that's major. That, that is major. Uh, the person who had another record before her, um, Ryan Coogler, Black Panther, um, he was the youngest, but now she's the youngest, too. So, I mean, I think it's major things that, that we're doing. Big ups to um, Nia and everything she's doing. Um, a lot of these um, um, black uh, directors and producers, I mean, they're putting out quality, quality work and it's showing. And we, we truly appreciate that. And you guys get a chance. Got to go see Candyman, man. Go check it out, all right? All right. And another thing, so now we're going to get into some of the events that's going on in, in the, the Carolina area, okay? Just in the Carolina area. Um, the International Sensation Stomp. You heard it was a hit. You heard it was a smash. A wonder. A phenomenon. An international sensation. But you haven't heard them. the best seats at dpacnc.com they will be here in um durham actually at the um durham performing arts center dpac it'll be september the 4th through the 5th okay so you guys go to blackups.com and you know click on that and you can look up stomp and you know purchase your ticket so you can go check it out all right also also coming in september cat williams the world war three tour Cat Williams will be live at PSC Arena on September 17th. So be sure to check Cat Williams out. Um, it's going to be funny. Um, Black Ops may be in the house. You know, we do that photo shoot thing. So Black Ops may be there as well. So maybe I'll see you guys in the crowd, get a little pic with you, you know, get you some publishing out there. But um, that's, that's going to be a, a concert that I'm really looking forward to. And I'm glad things are finally opening up. Uh, I think it was about two weeks ago, I was over at Coco Booth who was able to shoot the Jeffrey Osborne concert. That was, that was crazy. Jeffrey Osborne with Mother's Finest. You know, they opened up the show and they were in high gear the whole time. So, you know, that was a great show. It was outdoors at Coco Booth, which was pretty cool. And um, it was a great night. So I'm glad that these events are happening. We got these concerts coming up, these um, comedy shows coming up. And also, one more show for um, September. Uh, and actually, it's September 25th. It's the Temptations Review featuring Nate Evans. Okay, Temptations Review featuring Nate Evans. They're going to be a Coca booth. That's right. Uh, they will be there with the Will McBride group. 
So that'll probably be the opener. And that's going to be live September 25th at Coca Booth Amphitheater in Cary, North Carolina. So you guys, once again, go to blackops.com, you know, click on the link and buy your tickets, all right? Be sure to check that out. That should be a nice show as well. Now, coming in October, it's my man, yep, Uncle Charlie. Uncle Charlie will be back in the Bull City at DPAC live Sunday, October 3rd. And we are really looking forward to seeing Uncle Charlie, man. He'll bless us with another great concert. So, I mean, all, all, all these events are really, really lifting up everybody's spirits. Um, just make sure you're safe when you go. Because, you know, this this new variant's not playing. But these venues are not playing either. You got to come correct. And we want you to go correct, all right? So wear your mask, get your vac- vaccinations, get your booster. And yeah, we got to do boosters now. But uh, we want everybody to live, all right? We want everybody to be able to still socialize and, and have a good time until we want to go back into lockdown mode. So you guys be sure to do that if you can, all right? We, we would greatly appreciate it. I know a lot of these promoters, I mean, they were in lockdown mode like the rest of us back in 2020. But they were making some big plans, you know, come 2021 when things open up. So they made plans to so let us make plans to, to be able to go by being vaccinated, uh, wearing our masks and doing everything we need to do to keep these venues open and to, to give us a social life, some sense of normalcy. Because this thing is, is kicking our butt. And I think we can overcome it if we try. All right. That's the key word. We got to try it together to overcome it. All right. So, as an added incentive, yeah, I was, that was a big segue. Um, Black Ops Entertainment, and we haven't done this in a minute, but we're doing it this year because we feel like, you know, give you guys a little something extra to go on, all right? So, Black Ops Entertainment Summer Madness free ticket giveaway is in full effect right now. We just did uh, some ticket giveaways for the um, for Stomp that's going to be over d on September 4th and 5th. Uh, congratulations to the winners, and I, I'll list them later on our website on blackops.com. You guys could check out the winners. But right now, we're running a current uh, free ticket giveaway, Summer Madness free ticket giveaway to see Cat Williams. So if you want to see Cat Williams, make sure you register. So you got to go to our, um, go to blackops.com, click on Summer Madness, and make sure you're registered. Uh, now, we sent out the e blast, we posted it on. Um, social media platforms so if you see that link click on it shoot us an email to summer madness at blackops.com and if you're the first person or you're the tenth person or you're the fifteenth person whichever one it says that you should be uh, you check out the flyer to let you know and you will win tickets to these um, to this concert Cat Williams concert they will be e-tickets. I will have to text them to you, but they are good to go. You could use them to um, to get into the venues, okay? So that's just a couple of things that I was excited about that we had going on with Black Ops Entertainment. Uh, next time we come online, you guys will probably uh, hear from some of the, the promoters and some of these other um, um, entertainment entities and find out what they're doing, what they got going on. Um, for you guys, you know, to keep you guys entertained, uh, keep you social, um, lift your spirits just a little bit because we all need that, all right? And um, this one note I, I really have to talk about, and it's about, you know, Black Ops Entertainment. Of course, you know, we have Crush Model Magazine, right? You did know that, right? If not, I'm going to clue y'all in on something. But I want to give a special shout out to my whole Crush Model team, Aaliyah Hilton. She's our creative consultant for Crush Photography Studio and Crush Model Magazine. Fee Barker, she's one of our Crush models. And she walked in and modeled for Sophia Davis at the, um, I want to make sure I get this right, the 2021 Vogue Supermodel Competition. It was held a couple of weeks ago, actually last Sunday, in um, North Raleigh at the North Raleigh Hilton. Excellent event. Um, congratulations to um, Catherine Neal and Sophia Davis. Uh, they put on a great show. They had a bunch of beautiful models, uh, male and female, and they they really really represented. There was a lot of great designers there. There were some old school crush models I haven't seen in a long time. Shout out to Miss Yes, and she was there. Uh, my other friend um, Ashley Amber, she was there too. So it was good to see my uh, my model friends there. 
And my boy Sergio was in the building. What's up, Sergio? I see you, man. We got, we got to link up and do some stuff. But also, one of the things I wanted to say was um, congratulations to one of our newest crush models, really. She hasn't been modeling for over a year yet. She just started in November. Miss Zoe Walker. Out of the 35 adult contestants, she placed fourth. All right? That is a huge accomplishment. So congratulations to Zoe. Come on, y'all. Give it up. Yay, Zoe. Um, so she came in fourth place in the supermodel competition. And also, she got a trophy for most creative as well. Okay? So once again, big shout out to Catherine Neal and Sophia Davis for putting this all together. For um, putting on a stellar, stellar event. I mean, it, it was top notch. Nothing's going to be perfect because nothing ever is. But it, it turned out to be a very, very great event. Uh, we got some great shots. You'll be able to see some of the shots on um, Crush Model Magazine's website. Uh, that's CrushModelMagazine.com. You can go there, see some of the Crush models and some of the other models on there. And, um, yeah, it was just a really good event. And also, even though it might be a little bit late, but I already said it to her anyway, I wanted to say happy birthday to Miss Zoe Walker. Her birthday was yesterday, October, not October, man, um, August 31st. So uh, congratulations on the competition and happy birthday, Zoe. I call her baby girl. So a happy birthday, baby girl. Um, yeah, you made us all very, very proud. So shout out to you. Shout out to Fee Barker. She was walking for Sophia Davis in the, in the show, too. She got some great shots as well. And in my, my right hand, uh, I got to give it up to uh, Aaliyah Hilton. Um, this young lady, she, she's just super creative, super creative. And you guys probably seen her and thought she was a model because that's how she rolled. That's what she told me. That's how she rolled. You're going to think she a model because that's how she looked. But yeah, she did a great job helping out all the models and being very, very, very helpful for me and the Crush models as well. So that was great. And I, I was just glad to have her as a part of our team. Um, in closing, I just want to say I appreciate you guys. Next time it might be a little bit longer. Um, we got some more content. We got some people to talk to that you guys may want to hear from. So we may have a couple of things going on. I may be hanging out at the Cat Williams show. Maybe hanging out with the Temptations. You just never know. I may be at the, the Stomp thing. You just never know where I'm going to be at. But uh, I want to bring you guys some you know, real good content that you that you can really, really enjoy. Okay? But this is your boy, Damien, Black Ops Entertainment. I'm signing off for now. You guys be safe. You guys take care of each other. And i see you at the next go-round.